Uh, so we're gonna go to one cluster that should have a bird that just fledged or is still in the cavity, but I need to sex it, figure out. Um, I've already banded it about 20 days ago, and uh, so hopefully it survived. And, um, and then we'll go to two other clusters. One has a nest still, and we'll see if they hatched, and um, another cluster, their nest failed a couple weeks ago, so we're gonna see if they re-nested. Excellent. So for the first couple months after they, they leave the nest, um, it's really easy to tell the sex of the bird. Uh, females will have just a complete black head on the top, and then males will have a red dot. Um, but that goes away after their first molt. And then after that, it's very hard to distinguish a male and female uh, adult. You actually have to have them in your hand um, because the males only have the little red thing on the side but sometimes it's completely covered by other feathers. You kind of have to lift them up to see. So that's great. Kind of see it. You guys want to take a look? So you can kind of see. Here's like the the wall of the cavity, and then that's the bottom. You know, if there was eggs, you would see like you know three really distinct oh, yeah, white things. But 